Welcome to the six o'clock news. Those demonstrators arrived at Fordham's Lincoln Center campus early this morning, setting up tents inside the school. Yeah, let's get right to Fox 5's Richard Giacovis, who is live outside of the campus on the Upper West Side. Richard, paint the scene for us right now. Well, Bianca Natasha, I can tell you the scene has changed over the last 10 minutes a few times. We'll tell you that those encampments that were set up inside the Leon Lowenstein building here at Fordham University's Lincoln Center campus have officially been taken down. And NYPD officers in riot gear who have been here on campus for the last couple of hours moved into that building and removed those encampments that were set up by pro-Palestinian student demonstrators. Just in the last minute here, right before we went on the air at 6 o'clock, these protests some of them students, some of them potentially outside agitators, had moved from this location here on West 60th Street to the opposite side, to the 140 building. Now some of them just came back inside the building. They're taking down the signs and the tents. So there's a lot of confusion, and the officers in riot gear have just been told to mobilize again and to get ready. We'll show you some of the video from earlier. This is what's happening now. It was a little bit more hectic than fellow students who have set up encampments in the wake of other tent locations at Columbia and City College. You know, there were about a dozen or so tents inside the school building on West 60th and Columbus. Demonstrators have been calling for Fordham now to divest from companies they say are connected to Israel. The signs, some of them still hanging here in the glass windows, read, disclose, and divest, and students for Palestine liberation. We are hearing that the dean of students for Fordham wasted no time blasting an email out saying that participants in the encampment have been suspended from the university until, quote, the resolution of their case. We did hear one protester shout out here today, they have suspended our comrades without notification. We did witness at least one protester getting arrested. The NYPD has been given authority to make arrests. Now, we can't confirm, though, if any of the student demonstrators who were moved out of the Leon Lowenstein building here in West 60th were arrested or not. We've we've asked the NYPD to confirm if they have made any arrests. The correction vehicles have been set up here in West 60th Street. So far, we haven't seen any protesters being brought into them or any demonstrators. Right now, we can confirm, though, that the encampment here at Fordham University's Lincoln Center campus has been dismantled. There's no one inside the building anymore, and we are hearing that anyone who was part of that demonstration has been told they will be suspended immediately until their case is heard. We'll, of course, continue to update you here. It's a it's a very fluid situation. We have outside protesters who are moving back and forth now trying to maybe figure out where the protesters inside have gone. We'll find out, and we'll keep checking for you. So far, again, we cannot confirm that anyone has been arrested who was inside this afternoon. Right now, we're live outside of Fordham University's Lincoln Center campus on the Upper West Side. Richard Giacobbe, Fox 5 News, Bianca Natasha.